Tonight, has this award-winning actor found the fountain of youth? Two-time Oscar nominee, the great Nick Nolde, going strong at 60. Tonight's program is not about film or theater. Nick Nolte is featured, though, and later we'll bring in uh, the co-guests with him here, Dr. Braverman and Dr. Wow, but we'll start with Nick as to what this is all about. The basic topic is the use of human growth hormones to slow down the aging process. How did you hook on to this? Well, I, uh, oh, I would say about uh, five years ago, you know, in my about 55, I started to realize that my body was just going to deteriorate in a natural way and we found out what my testosterone level was which was low uh, probably not low for my age but but low in relationship to being re able to repair tissue the process was you wanted to live longer or be younger or well I wanted was your to, goal? I wanted to live the best I could at the moment I wanted to live as healthy as I could. For as long as you could. As long as I could, yes. Uh, but to live forever is not my dream. You know, that's not the point. But to live uh, in the best way. So, uh, in the hormone area, it, we replaced the testosterone, and it's controversial in that area, and then we replaced in growth hormone, and growth hormone was low too. Uh, the effects... They gave you a new one? They gave you new hormones? New hormones, yes. And... and uh, for me, uh, it repaired a lot of cartilage. I had a frozen rotator cuff that I'd been working on for five years, and uh, after this testosterone and growth hormone, I was able to free it, and it came back. This arm was atrophied, smaller than this arm. This arm came back. And, of course, I monitored my uh, hormone levels and watched it and watched my PSA and made sure that didn't go into prostate. And did you become totally intrigued with it? I mean, did it now become a way of life for you? Yes, it has become a way of life because, you know, from, from that, from hormones to, and the vitamins, uh,